Welcome back to another video. Today, I was able to get my hand on some 2020 Optic Donruss, and it is the Hobby Box. So that's what we're gonna be opening up today. And while I'm getting this thing cut open and everything, let me know what you guys think. I think the general consensus on Optic is that it is extremely overpriced for what it is. Um, but after looking on eBay and stuff, if I do get cards that are worth quite a bit that I don't wanna keep for like a PC or anything, then it looks like you can get quite a bit of your money back. So it'll just be interesting to see what we can get. Um, and I didn't get this from a scalper or anything like that. Thankfully, uh, all I did was get it from my LCS. And let's see if I can punch this guy out. Get it folded and make it look nice and pretty. There we go. It's as pretty as I'm going to get it. And then we can go ahead and start the ripping. So each one, you get four cards per pack out of here. And just because I forgot, you can have one auto per box on average, which isn't a lot for the price point. But there are quite a few different parallels that I've seen out there that have also gone for hundreds of dollars, even without uh, an auto or anything. So that's very promising. We are going to start off with a Tom Brady. And if his cards weren't going up so much, I would hate it, um, being a Colts and Packers fan, uh, but hey, good on him. Next up, we have a DJ Shark, and then this next one is going to be an OBJ, and the final card on the back is a rookie, and it is Quintez Cephas, so as our first rookie. I've watched quite a few people open some boxes on here, and it's been fun uh, to watch them open it. And I've seen some amazing pulls. Uh, the downtowns look phenomenal. Uh, Derek Carr, a Calvin Ridley, and then this card here is upside down, so let's flip. It's not going to be a rookie or anything. It's going to be a Zeke, and I really like how these ones look because it's at a 2.99 number five so it's a low number but I, I just like the coloring of all of these and then on the back we do have a and we also got that numbered Zeke as well and I'll put that guy up there but the downtown, uh, what, one per case? I'm not entirely sure how many boxes come in a case, so I don't know the odds on that guy. But get this guy opened. And we already saw the card on the back. So that is a rated rookie Clyde Edwards Hilaire, which I will sleeve up here in a moment once we get through this pack. We're starting off with the Sam Darnold. Got us a Von Miller. And then this card is the backwards one. And is it, it's, it's a bookend, all right, 99 to 99. But I'm mainly curious. I don't think it's an auto or else it would have said it. Let's flip it and see. Ooh, Chase Young rated rookie again. So, I mean, hey, that's two packs in a row. We got a base Chase Young rated rookie. We have one that is numbered 99 of 99. So, not only do we have a parallel of it, but we also have a bookend, also known as an eBay one of one. So that is pretty amazing as well. So I will stack that on top of that other Chase Young. And then we have Von Miller here. So real quick, just to make sure I'm diligent on it, because unless it's a player that I really like or a card that I really like, I don't really plan on holding on to these guys too much. But go ahead and sleeve up that Edwards Hilaire. And that's just because I have to recoup some of the cost from a box that is this expensive. So awesome. I thought that might have been our auto that we had, and that wouldn't have been a bad one uh, with Chase Young, but kind of happy we didn't break it out right in the beginning. But we're going to start this back off with a Julio. Have a Stefan Gilmore. Next, looks like it's a Josh Allen base. And then the back is going to be a rookie, Devin Asi Asi. So I'll put that in just our rated, regular rookie pile, not the rated rookie pile. 
this one opened up. Matt Ryan. A Cam Newton. This one looks like it is a silver, and it's going to be a silver Julian Edelman. And then the back is a regular rookie, and that's going to be Jordan Brooks. So put that Edelman on top of the Zeke. And move forward. That pack wasn't anything too insane. That Chase Young, um, I, I, I couldn't believe it. Um, I know there's numbers out of here, but that's still an awesome one to hit. Julian Edelman and A.J. Green. And then behind him, we have a rated rookie, Red. And it's the silver for the Cardinals. It's Isaiah Simmons. And then on the very back, we have a Clavon Chasen. So for this rated rookie, I don't think the silvers are numbered. They're just short print, if I recall. But it is still a parallel. It's not the base. So I will, so I can figure out the proper end on the sleeve. Sleeve her up, Isaiah Simmons. The one thing I do like about these packs is that the rookies are always on the back, so it's not like you flip through and uh, it's only like the second card that you see it, or at least the inserts are the second to last card. But we're going to have a Baker here, a Juju Smith-Schuster. For this one, it's going to be another silver. It's not going to be a rookie or anything. It's going to be a Calvin Ridley silver. And on the back, we have a rookie of Jalen Johnson. Yeah, and put that in the appropriate rookies pile here. Let's see what we have up next. All right, got a DK Metcalf, a Gardner Minshew. Our third card is going to be a regular Mike Williams. On the back, it's going to be a rookie Jeff. Gladney. My only hope is uh, all my luck didn't get spent on that Chase Young Red rookie. Let's see here. Big Ben Roethlisberger. Have us an Aaron Jones. As a Packers fan, that is a nice little PC hit. And then on the back here, just a regular Michael Thomas. And Aaron Jones can go with a separate pile for Packers. Michael Thomas and then a Marlin. Davidson. A Larry Fitzgerald. Dalvin Cook. And then on the back here, it's going to be Optic Prism. And this might be our auto to 75. That is the auto, so I will hold that one right there until I get through the rest of these guys so we don't spoil that one too soon. But you guys did see the autos out of 75. So um, I believe just the base rated rookie autos, if that is a rated rookie, um, for those, they don't quite uh, go to 75. Normally they go to 150. Um, so that's a pretty good sign. Could be a good player with a low uh, population number. But Devontae Adams, so another Packer can go on our Packer pile. We have A.J. Brown. This next card is going to be a silver, and it will be a rookie. It's going to be Jordan Brooks. And then the card on the back is another one, and that's Xavier McKinney. So put that in the parallels and put that in the rookies. Next, we have a Joe Mixon. A Jason Kelsey, and we have an orange, it looks like. If I can slide this one down enough for the Titans. I don't believe it's going to be a rookie or anything. Oh, it is. A rated rookie, Darrington Evans. And then behind this guy, we have a rated rookie, Justin Jefferson. Okay. All right, one pack had two of our rated rookies. The Jefferson is just a base, so we will... Sleeve that guy up, put that in the rated rookie pile, and then this Darrington Evans is 99 of 199. 
I'm running out of little sleeves. I didn't quite bring enough over to this table. But Darrington Evans, rated rookie. I believe we get, what, six of these so far. One, two, three, four, five, six. So that may be it for the rated rookies. But we still have other rookie cards that we can get. And there are plenty of others out there that are going to be the short print as well. All right. Next we have Ryan Tannehill. Austin Eckler. We have a Titans. This is another Darrington. <laughs> Titans rookie. It's going to be a Christian Fulton rookie. And on the back, a rated rookie, Cole Komet. Get this guy sleeved. And there we are. And then this Darrington Evans. The Blues are at a 179. It's number seven of that. I feel like there are just so many packs in here. Since each one only comes with four cards, they're the 20 packs total. So it doesn't feel like it's a ton, but you start jumping through everything and they really just start to add up. Get this top ripped away. There we go. We have David Montgomery, Carson Wentz, and it's going to be a Disco Prism for the Bills. Josh Allen. It's a rated rookie for the Bills. Prism. It's going to be a Zach Moss. I like that a lot. Then the second card is going to be the Bucks. Oh, well, drop the Zach Moss. But rated rookie Kashawn Vaughn and Zach Moss for that. I know the Vaughn isn't numbered. Are these? They are out of 125. Number 40 of 125. And like I predicted, I'll have to grab more sleeves. More sleeves have been grabbed, and I'm going to go ahead and sleeve up this Zach Moss. I really like how those look. And I think it's funny how I said, oh, there's only a limited number of rated rookies that you have in a uh, hobby box, because that's what I saw in the videos that I've watched, but it seems like quite a few of them have been pretty amazing. And we saw where Otto sitting there out of the 75 as well. Definitely not bad. Next up, Keenan Allen, Mark Andrews, and this one's going to be like a dark blue for the Broncos, a Jerry Judy, perhaps. It's a rated rookie of KJ Hamler. And the back one is going to be Bengals, please be a Burrow. A rated rookie, Joe Burrow. Yeah, all right. I am excited. Um, out of this box, the base ones don't go for too much, but um, I still just love to have these rookie cards. So a Joe Burrow was amazing. A KJ Hamler, and it's the dark blue. So that'll make it out of 179, 97 of 179. And yeah, we're just getting a ton of rated rookies. I, I could swear. So 20 rookies or rated rookies. And I, I swear in the videos I watched, they talked about how there's only around six um, rated rookies and the rest were just going to be the regular rookie cards. So it's never going to be anything too insane. But we do have a Rogers, a regular season MVP going in our Packers pile. We have Derrick Henry. Next up, looks like it's just going to be a regular TJ Watts. And then on the back, we have a rookie, Nate Stanley. And put that in the base ones. Looks like we have four packs left, and then we have our auto as well. We have a Max Crosby, Lamar Jackson. Next up is going to be, I think this is the T minus or the, the My House, Von Miller. So that'll be an insert. Then on the back, we have Vikings rookie kj osborne and the my house i don't think any of these are numbered they're just seen as an insert uh so i'll just throw it in the parallels one but kj osborne rookie we might have gotten all of our rookies out of these so far still be hopeful as far as like the rated rookies go 
We have a Alvin Kamara, a Nick Chubb on the back here. It looks like it's going to be a rookie, LaVisca Chenault, Elite Series rookies. And on the final card, uh, Kyle Duggar. So I'll do this. Put Chenault there, put Duggar in the regular rookie pile. Marquise Brown, Drew Brees, and this one's going to be our Dominators, more than likely a Saquon maybe, yep, Saquon Barkley, and then we have our rookie AJ Epinesa, and for the Dominators cards, let's set that one down for a moment, I do like how these guys look, um, I've had some Dominators, I mean, even that Rogers, even though it's only Donruss, it's still a Dominator uh, card. But, yeah, I like the look of these guys. And what's nice about Optic is they're always nice and shiny. So we're on to our final pack here. Let's hope for some last pack magic of something else that's going to be absolutely great. And then let's keep our fingers crossed on that uh, auto as well. And hope we can pull a huge name out of there for some autos. We're going to start this final pack off with Kenny Galladay. Rob Gronkowski. This is going to be our T-minus. It's going to be an old one. A Fran Tarkenton for the Vikings. That's the retro. And then this final one's going to be a rookie, Andrew Thomas. And for these retros, I've seen people pull these. I think they look like pretty cool cards. Um, just another insert, really. Let's get on to this final one, see if I can pick this up properly. So Dalvin Cook, I know we pulled it from the bottom before, um, and that's how we knew it was the optic prism and everything. We didn't go too far. One thing I will do is I'll pull this back one up a little bit, see what it is. Just a regular rookie of Harrison Bryant. And I'm going to try to slow roll this, but I'll probably end up messing it up. I think I did. So Darnell Mooney, so it's going to be. And it's going to be our auto out of 75. So we have that. And let's flip it around. So it's going to be a silver Darno Mooney rookie. So not a rated rookie or anything like that. But still pretty decent auto. So we'll get that going. And of course, the auto is for the Bears. That's just my luck. But... Let's go ahead and go through everything, and I will show you pretty much what we got. So, started off strong with a Chase Young rookie. Our very next pack had a Chase Young rookie out of 99, and it was the bookend. So, it was kind of crazy, two Chase Youngs in a row. We then got a Clyde Edwards-Hilaire rated rookie. Isaiah Simmons, Justin Jefferson rated rookie, Darrington Evans, Cole Komet, we got this really awesome Zach Moss. Got the Kishon Vaughn. We did pull a Joe Burrow rated rookie, which is awesome to see. A KJ Hamler. And then finally, our Darnell Mooney. So it was a rookie auto, so it's not horrible. It is a sticker auto. Uh, the hope is always, since it can be on card, that it, it will be on card. Uh, but I cannot complain about that. Everything else uh, wasn't too insane. We got plenty of other rookies that weren't rated rookies uh, for the parallels, like the light blues and silvers and everything. Just going through those guys real quick. Just to show you guys what we got here. And that'll be it. So thanks for watching the video. Uh, be sure to check out my other videos as well as subscribe to the channel. I have a lot of videos in queue that just need to be edited and then uh, uploaded but I'm really working on building up this channel because I really do love this hobby or else I wouldn't have spent a few hundred dollars uh, on a box like this. And for me, it's just fun. It's just a hobby that I think more people should get behind if the prices can come down to where they're not absolutely insane for people uh, out there. So us regular people can buy more product, pull more packs. But thank you guys again and hope to see you next time.